Hello everyone, welcome back. Today I'll be making chicken pan pizza. This is not the traditional way of making pizza, but I'll be making my own changes. To start off, I'll be making the dough. So to, for the dough, I'm adding one kg of flour. Following the flour, I'm adding one and a half tablespoon of sugar. Now I'm adding two teaspoon of salt. So this is the big change I'm doing. Uh, this is Ceylon uh, Alba Cinnamon, which I'm adding to the dough, which is which will enhance the flavor of our dough and the, the taste of it. Uh, this has a nice uh, smell, the fragrance is really good and uh, this will change our taste buds uh, when, when we are eating the pizza. Now I'm adding uh, one tablespoon of uh, dried herbs which has rosemary, oregano and my final dry ingredient is uh, yeast, dry yeast. So I'm adding around half a tablespoon of dry yeast. Now I'm mixing uh, my dry ingredients together. I have mixed my dry ingredients together now. Now I'm uh, adding around three tablespoons of olive oil. So now I'm adding a warm fresh milk to the dough. So now I have mixed the dough. As you can see, you can see the cinnamon and the dry herbs around it. So I will rest it for a couple of hours. Before doing so, I'm adding some olive oil for the dough. So over here I have the chicken there which has been marinating for a few hours now. I have marinated it with salt, pepper and some chili powder. So this will be our topping for pizza. Now I'm roasting my chicken for 20 minutes at 180 degrees. Now I'll be chopping some garlic and onion for the sauce. So I'm adding some olive oil to the pan to saute the, add the onion and garlic for our sauce. Now to begin off, I will add the garlic. Now uh, the garlic has been sorted for a few uh, seconds, now it has uh, its uh, golden color. Now I'm adding the onion. Our uh, veggies has been sorted for a few, min uh, few minutes now. Now I'm, I'm adding uh, salt. Now uh, I'm, I'm adding uh, pepper. Uh, chili powder. and some dry herbs. So our ingredients have been sorted together and cooked together. Now I'm adding the tomato puree. Our sauce is starting to simmer now. So finally I'm adding some sugar. For the topping, I'm slicing some uh, capsicum. The same goes for onion as well and tomatoes as well. For the topping, I will be adding some button mushroom as well. Now the chicken has uh, roasted and now I'm going to shred it. So I'm cutting the chicken into like small pieces. I'm slicing it actually. Before I put my dough, I'm going to add some olive oil to the pan. So our dough has risen and I'm just uh, rolling it out to the pan and now I will spread it uh, widely as well. So I have uh, spread the dough into my pan. So I'm just poking some holes from my fork, uh, fork to so that the heat can penetrate, penetrate from the bottom of the pan to the top. So this is the sauce that we made earlier. So it has been isolated for a few minutes and then I cooled it down now. So now I'm going to spread it 
to into the dough. So I have spread the sauce already. Now I'm adding the topping for pizza. So I'm going starting off with a uh, capsicum or bell pepper. Now I'm layering it with the our chicken. Now I'm adding the tomatoes. Following that, I'm adding the onion. Onion slices. Following that, I am uh, adding some sliced sausages. Following with the red capsicums. Following with the sliced mushrooms. Finally, for my fresh ingredients, uh, I'm adding the orange capsicum. I'm spreading some cheese. So this is the leg uh, legato hard cheese. So I have preheated my oven. Now I'm gonna put my oven for uh, put my pizza for half an hour at 130 degrees. So let's check out our end product. As you guys can see, the pizza uh, turned out really great. Uh, it's actually better than uh, what I expected, and I hope I hope to. The smell and the fragrance is uh, really uh, great. It's uh, it is the smell and the fragrance is really similar to what you get the authentic pizza you get please uh, support my channel by liking this video and please subscribe to my channel as well and watching my other videos as well please share it among your friends uh, i hope you guys try this at home and thank you for watching see you soon